climate. Coachella is one of America's largest and most respected music festivals. Took place over this weekend. All the stars came out, all the biggest names. I mean, Outkast reunited at Coachella. Arcade Fire, Lord. It was a weekend full of surprise guests and reunions, too. Jay-Z came out in the middle of Nas's set. Whoa. And Pharrell, under his hat, was a thousand guests. I mean, Pharrell came out with Diddy. Gwen Stefani somehow wandered on stage and did holla back, girl. Snoop Dogg came out and did Beautiful and dropped it like it's hot. Wait a minute, Snoop Dogg or Snoop Lion? It was Snoop Dogg. Okay. There was no mane or tail. <laughs> <laughs> and also, Beyonce came out and surprised everybody and did a song with Solange. So, yeah. but you know what? I, I thought that was kind of tacky of Jay-Z and Beyonce. Why did they didn't get on the lineup? Like Be everybody else. Because he performed at Coachella previously, and it's like time to let other people shine. But the uh, cool. What you but saying? listen, though. But here's the cool part, Gary. The fact that Jay Z and Nas had beef at one point in time, for them to be able to put all that behind them mm -hmm. and come out and, like, you know, show brotherhood and unity in this hip hop game, that's a beautiful thing. And well, what about Justin Bieber, dog? Justin, you know, now Justin Bieber, he's like still trying to find his way within the black community. So he's real cool with Chance the Rapper. They even got a couple songs together. So Justin Bieber was kind of like Chance the Rapper's hype man. I like it. I yeah. like to see a white person be the hype man for a black rapper. <laughs> <laughs> Get on your own time. Sign up to go. If you're going on other people's time and stuff, you're taking from them. Well, do you know Chance the Rapper? That's what I want. Who in the hell is he? <laughs> So, like, all right, so, Gary, what did you think about the way people were dressed at Coachella? Now, we all know that you can't spell Coachella without the word hella. And these actors and actors, they were looking a hell of a different. You know who looked really interesting? Who? Vanessa Hudgens. Because if you didn't know what was going on, you wouldn't know it was Vanessa Hudgens. And then you have uh, Steven Tyler. Now, that's his look on a regular. But I love the sheer shirt. Because when mm -hmm. a man can wear a sheer shirt, that shows that he's very masculine. And there was the black guy. Who? Diddy. With that damn Mercedes Benz medallion on his neck. I'm like, okay, Diddy. You know, Diddy just has to show, hey, I have more money than everybody, and I'm gonna slightly oppress you with my fashion. <laughs> <laughs> You know, at Ebony, all the girls were wearing flowers. You know, mm, like I said, mm. I guess maybe, I don't know if it's a flower child season or what else, but I mean, you had Kylie Jenner, Sarah Hyland, Emmy Rossum, and you know, Paris Hilton. All these girls were wearing flowers. I love that look. But isn't it so nice that after they, everybody took the flowers out of their hair, they gave them to the Gary? He put them in his shirt? Yep. <laughs> he made a little shirt bouquet. <laughs> That's your Coachella shirt? That's my Coachella shirt, baby. <laughs>